hello everyone welcome back to my unreal engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game so in the rage attack mode that we were working on i am going to add a couple more improvements so i am going to add a different and a camera shake and i am going to uh, change the speed of the attack animations when my character is in the rage mode so here is the preview I'll charge my character another rage mode now as you can see the animations are faster And also, you may notice that there is a much drastic camera shake as well. Alright. And as always, this episode is sponsored by these generous Patreons. Thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me. Right, so further improvements for the rage mod. So the first thing I'm going to do is this. I'm going to speed up the attacks. So first I'll open my character blueprint here. And this is the normal attack animation montage play rate this is for the normal attacks and this is for the charged attacks let's uh, I'll show you only the normal attack part so here this is the first play rate uh, the normal play rate 1.6 so I will do it like this let's do a select note and for this one rage enabled if the rage is enabled the speed should be let's say 2.2 the normal no this is this is the normal that means 1.6 and this is the rage mode 2.2 Okay, let's see how it works. This is the normal attack speed. So I'll toggle rage mode. Okay, as you can see, the attack is much faster and it looks a little bit unrealistic too so therefore let's stop at 2 and see good enough and the next thing I want to work on is the camera shake at the moment I have added a camera shake right here when I do the check hit event I have added this camera shake and I'll show it how does the current camera shake looks here play attention at the middle of the attack the camera shakes that one yes that that okay so for the rage mode I think I'm I think it would be better 
if I do some special shake so this is the current shake I'll duplicate this shake attack rage and these are the settings for the camera shake the current settings so I'll increase this amplitude of the roll to what 45 and what else I can change FOV oscillation let's do this one let's try 20 I let's I'm not sure that would be too drastic let's see oh I didn't play that so here just like before let's do a select and for this selector let's use rage enabled and if it is false I should use this one shake attack if, uh, sorry if it is true I should use shake attack rage if it is false I should use shake attack just shake attack and let's see So should I increase the time a little bit yeah let's try that instead of 0.3 let's go for 0.4 and see how it looks that's much better and if you think it requires more fine-tuning you can work on it on your own I this is I think I have showed the way to do it and uh, that's all I wanted to do for today and in the next episode I think uh, I'm a little bit tired of with uh, melee combat so let's uh, do some different topic maybe range attack like bow and arrow or any other topic I haven't thought about it yet and I'll upload the updated source codes into the, my patreon page as well so if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club and depending on the tier you join you will have different privileges as I have explained here and see you in the next episode. Goodbye.